tri-state forecast that's independently certified most accurate. Here's Chief Meteorologist Kevin Robinson. Well, here's something we certainly look forward to on a Friday evening. Despite the fact we had a few rogue sprinkles sneak their way into the area earlier this afternoon and this morning, it looks like we're going to enjoy a dry evening because look how far away the rain is from the tri state right now. All the wet weather still back across parts of Illinois, Iowa, and Missouri. So we are safe around here this evening. Enjoy the late summer weather here to kick off the weekend and Oktoberfest and many other activities going on across the area. Matter of fact, here's your forecast for. For your Oktoberfest weekend here in Cincinnati. This evening is going to be warm and sunny. Again, just about perfect out there. Temperatures in the low 80s here through the evening hours, slowly sinking back through the 70s. You don't have to worry about any rainfall out there. That's tomorrow. That's on Saturday. But even Saturday, it's just a narrow window of opportunity here. It's not going to be a washout on Saturday, but I do think there's a few hours, Saturday afternoon, kind of midday, early into the evening, in which we could have a quick band of showers pushing through the area. That will be followed by the return of sunshine and a cooler Sunday. A matter of fact, temperatures will be about 10 to 12 degrees cooler than they are right now or have been most of this week. Outside at the airport, 82 degrees right now. We've got a nice breeze out of the south at 10. Look at our dew point. It's up into the 60s. So, again, I mentioned yesterday that humidity levels would kind of tiptoe their way up just a little bit, but it's still going to be very pleasant out there. 80 in Dayton, 82 in Indianapolis, 87 in Louisville. There, there's some heat, though. 90 in Evansville, back towards Paducah. Cold front's going to get here before we have an opportunity to get that hot this weekend. So here comes that frontal system. We're still on the warm side of the cold front right now as the storm center is kind of organizing between St. Louis and Kansas City. It is going to zip its way up towards Detroit and basically drag a cold front through the area tomorrow. You'll see it right here on Futurecast. Quiet overnight tonight. Expect mostly clear skies. Again, a very pleasant Friday evening and overnight. Here's 630 Saturday morning. It's starting out on the dry side. Probably some sun the first half of the day, too, but then we'll cloud up pretty quick. And I keep the window there. Anytime between about noon and let's say five or six in the evening, I do expect a quick moving band of showers, maybe a rumble of thunder. It doesn't look like a lot of rain, but enough to provide some wet weather, though, tomorrow afternoon. But notice by five, six, that's already clearing the area. Now you will notice tomorrow night it does turn considerably cooler. And then as we get into Sunday, we'll have plenty of sunshine. But as I mentioned, it will again be cooler behind that front for the second half of the weekend. 64 for a low tonight underneath partly cloudy skies. And then tomorrow, expect a line of afternoon showers, maybe a storm. Look for a high close to 80. Here's a look at your seven day forecast. And I've been calling this only a hiccup because look at this stretch of weather beyond Saturday here. We're talking sunshine through the end of next week. And we welcome in fall too with some very comfortable temperatures between 75 and 80. All right, Kevin.